So welcome back everyone, Mike here. Just got home from work a few minutes ago and it is exactly 5.49 p.m. So I have about an hour and a half to get a few things done this evening. Nothing that I need to do or anything that I have to do. It's just when I get home from work, there's nothing I like more than, you know, getting on the tractor, cutting some firewood, doing something to feel like you accomplished something here at home because all day long you kind of work for somebody else. So when I get home, I like to do things on the property and it helps me kind of relax and unwind and I just really enjoy doing it. It's kind of my thing. Uh, so I don't have a whole lot of time tonight, but there are a few things that I'd like to get done. One is this trail behind me. I'll show you what I got going on here. So down that way about 75 yards or so, I guess you could call that like the trailhead. That's where you get onto the trail off of the stone. It comes around, comes up this little hill right here. Goes out that way and around and then way back in the woods. And this trail here ends up making about a, a mile and a half loop. Goes over by my mom's place. Kind of as far as you can see that tree line on the far hill over there. You know, loops around, comes back up by the pond. But anyway, this section right here, when I'm out working in the woods out here behind the house, this always stays just a little bit soft and it's steep and I'm always sliding on it. And I'm gonna to try to fix that tonight. It's not gonna be like a permanent fix or anything like that. Cause it'll be fine when it dries up anyway. And that's usually when I'm out in the woods doing things. But like right now, it's pretty decent out there except for this one spot. And when you're coming down here with a load of wood or whatever, you, it wants to, you, know, you have a tendency to want to slide down that hill. So I have some 2B limestone. I'm gonna just get a couple buckets in the RK55, bring it up and spread some on this section of trail. This is no means, you know, it's not like I'm putting in a driveway or anything like that. You'd want to strip all that topsoil off, put some good base rock down. But I have some stone, I'll put some on there. It'll give it a little bit of grit and it'll kind of mix in with the dirt, help tighten it up a little bit. It's not going to be perfect, but it's definitely going to help and uh, it'll kind of keep me from sliding down that hill. And the other thing that I'll do, every time I leave the woods, my tires are kind of getting loaded up with mud right here at the last section and you drag it up by the house. So it'll kind of help with that as well. Here comes Melissa with uh, Piper, our uh, youngest golden retriever. Piper got her hair done today and coincidentally so did Melissa. Not at the same place though. Wow, look, look at Piper. how pretty. I was just, I was just telling them that uh, you both got your hair done today but yeah. not at the same place. Yeah, except I didn't lose 20 pounds. <laughs> Don't you look so pretty? Huh? How, how did she do, did they say? She did good. She can sometimes get anxious and pant. And then they had a uh, Chesapeake Bay Retriever in there. Beautiful, but young. And uh, she was anxious too. So the two of them together were, let's just say they earned their money. <laughs> oh. What do you think? Yeah. Oh, you look so pretty. She got this cute little neckerchief. And I um, I should mention a thank you to Trudy and Annette in Mars. They do that. It's Forever Green. And I, when I post what's it these, called? Forever Green. Yeah. And when I post the pictures coming home from the groomers, I always tag them. So anyone that wants to check them out. All right. I'm going to, uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I'm going to fix this little section of trail up right here. Maybe oh, cut yeah. a little wood. Okay. Got about an hour and a half before it gets Yeah. Started. Okay, good.
some jeans and my boots And then it's time to make that morning dry Work all day till I'm totally beat Get back home and fall right to sleep Along goes on, friend, the morning and the cycle's complete Work, sleep, repeat So that's not a real beautiful job or anything. I kind of call that putting lipstick on a pig, but it can't hurt. And uh, what'll happen is where my tire tracks are, that stone will just sink down in the mud a little bit. I'll have some stone in between it. When it dries up a little bit, I'll hit it with the back blade, fill in those ruts. Like I said, I was just trying to get a little bit of grit to it and kind of firm it up a little bit. And I think it'll work just fine for that. But anyway, it is now 6.15. I'm gonna go cut a little firewood. Like yesterday, I was 17, running boot lanes and draws and screens. Now I'm running up dead and I'm scrambling to make ends meet. So work, sleep, repeat. That's a nice load of cherry there. Well, that was pretty good timing. I just got loaded up. It's just about dark. It's uh, 7.23 right now, not too bad. Got dark a little earlier tonight uh, compared to last night. Uh, last night it was beautiful, nice clear blue skies. Tonight it's a little bit overcast. It was actually uh, sprinkling there for a little bit. I was kind of getting a little nervous. You wouldn't want to be out here and get caught in a big downpour kind of makes it hard to get back to the house you know with the trailer loaded with wood and all that but anyway yeah this was a pretty good evening uh i forget what time i even got home but didn't spend much time at all i got that trail kind of fixed up got a load of wood in and i think that's about it i'm going to call today head to the house uh, but if you enjoy these videos please hit the like button click subscribe and share them with your friends thanks <laughs>